Hi everyone, here I am live in Jerusalem, Yushlaim Shel Zahav. Going to concentrate on a few words within regards to the Daf Yomi today. Today we are dealing with Masechet Nazir. We are talking about Daf Hay, that is page number five, respectively. Here I am in the center of Jerusalem, right next to the Tachanama Kazit, as they say, right next to the railway train, right uh, behind me. I thought, what better place to share over some words of Torah of this precious the Talmud, which we're doing the Daf Yomi every single day. So we are going to be on page number five of Tractate Nazir. So what's it talking about over here? So, so far, as I've said every day, I'll give you a background again of what a Nazir is, a Nazrite. A Nazrite is a person that will take upon himself three different things. To abstain from wine, great products that could even include raisins and wine naturally and all those things. Also, not to come in contact with a dead body, a corpse, and not to cut his hair or shave. Now, how long is a Nazarite status? Many of us will probably know the story of Samson, Shimshon, Hagibor, that he was a Nazarite upon life. So some people take on many years, but the Mishnah in today's uh, Talmud is going to state that a Nazarite takes upon himself by default 30 days. It's 30 days. That's what a commentator would say. So why is it 30 days over here, friends? Why is it? So a Rav Matana is going to come in inside the Mishnah and he's going to rely, uh, relate over its 30 days because he quotes, he uses a Pasuk, a verse inside Parashat Naso in the book of Bamidbar, which says, Kadosh Yiyeh. So he says that this word Yiyeh, which is referring to the Kadosh, to the Nazrite, is, has got the numerical value of 30. So how is this, friends? How is it 30? So let's add it up together. I'm a good mathematician here. A Yud is 10. A He is 5. Another yud is 10, another hay is 5. So that equals to 30 naturally. So from darshaning from that pasuk, the pasuk, it's going to be 30 days naturally according to Rav Matana. However, this also, he relates over that this could be a halacha me Moshe Har Sinai. Moshe received the oral Torah at Har Sinai when he went up the heavenly realms. And this was one of the things he was taught over that it's 30 days. Uh, the Nazarite uh, status of the person, if he doesn't specify the amount of days, the greater amount of days it is, it will naturally end up being 30 days would be this status, and which is very much related to that. Other Rabbonim are going to have other opinions about how many, why it's 30 days they're going to bring over. For example, they're going to bring about that Eshet Yepet has got a 30 days and also a full month. There's a full month and a uh, shorter month, a shorter cycle. The shorter month is 29 days, but a full month naturally is uh, 30 days over here. And that's what is what's related over inside this precious Talmud of the Daf Yomi today. Yerushalayim, I'll add another word about here. Here I'm in the best place in the world. Yerushalayim stands for Yira Shalem, that is fear and tranquility together. And that's, this is the best place in the world. I'll leave you with some scenes here of Jerusalem. And, uh, Incredible uh, scenes over here. I'll just uh, show you now. I'm just crossing a uh, intersection road over here, and uh, I'll give you some scenes over here of Jerusalem. If you can see the hills over here, this is the actual center place of Jerusalem. This is, guys. Have an awesome day and uh, Shabbat Shalom. Bye.